What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another band-made reaction. We're going to take a look at the song called Ambition or Hong Kai or Hong K. But anyway, let's do it. Ambition. Yeah, so far with those powerful ass riffs, it's giving me like a three days grace vibe, man. And that intro riff uh, <clears throat> really was kind of like some more of that throwback sound we've been getting a lot of recently. But yeah, that powerful riff it just came out of really has a, like a three days grace vibe to it. Wow. Yeah, we'll definitely go back through this one. There's a lot going on. That was like a crazy chaos section there. A lot of proggy elements, I would say. This is nice, man. The vocals are really nice on here, too. Like, the last song, I know it's like, I got like some weird version. It was like a fan-made instrumental, and once I listened back to it, it really wasn't the best, but that last song, either way, kind of like, I found it to be better as an instrumental, but I'm not getting the vibe with this one. I mean, I do love instrumentals because you can focus on a lot more of the instruments and what's going on, but this one, the vocals are just, I have no problem with them at all. They're perfect. It's psyche. What, what can you expect, you know? But yeah, dude, I want to see that little section again. <laughs>
Wow. <laughs> Holy shit. <clears throat> Damn. There's so many amazing sections in this song. I love how they like started and ended with that same riff, just like a nice sealed up package. <laughs> oh man. I could see this being an instrumental, but the vocals were so nice on this one. They were just that solid, catchy, poppy chorus. It just contrasts nicely with the chaos going on instrumentally. But, man, let's go back through it because, yeah, it's a lot to a lot to take in. But, yeah, this, this intro riff gives me like a throwback kind of Three Days Grace vibe. <laughs> the bass when the bass came in there that was sick so amazing how they can how she can just create these massive expansions of sound throughout the song like i don't even know how to describe it anymore but it's just there's perfection man how is she so good i don't understand <laughs> What a transition. <laughs> like how heavy the bass is right here. to go back through that section again i figure out what the heck is going on here very proggy in this section <clears throat> just the way the notes are lining up and kind of an unconventional keeping you on your toes not giving you a chance to relax like a whole different song god i don't want to pause it during a solo but she switched to like a whole different song and at the end of that hold on the intro to this solo is fucking perfect man Someday. 
Now, this intro riff at the end is uh, is perfect. It's probably a little bit to come, but... fucking uh they do it again <laughs> they did it again god damn it i'm obsessed with the way this solo comes in i gotta hear this a couple more times all right we're gonna demonstrate how to play this solo okay Yeah, one can dream, right? I'll be the sixth member of Bandmade. Anyway, that was fun. <laughs> uh, one more time for this solo. Damn, dude. <clears throat> Fucking amazing. So many solid riffs and power chords and just the build-ups, the transitions, the little proggy chaos, the overlaying, poppy, amazing vocals. Misa killed it on a several occasions, and this one, Konami solo, dude, that's my favorite part of this song. I do really like the intro and outro riffs. That's probably my second favorite part. Third favorite part's that crazy, wild, proggy section in the middle, but damn what an amazing fucking song as usual uh still being surprised somehow at their awesomeness i don't know maybe that's just something that never ends <laughs> you just we're always going to be surprised no matter how used to them we get no matter how many times we listen to them they're still exceeding expectations and man so glad i picked this band to do this journey on because I knew they were good. I didn't realize that every album and pretty much every fucking song would be good, you know. Some songs were a little, you know, lackluster, but even still, those lackluster songs that Bandmade has are still better than a lot of music out there. So, anyway, this was Ambition, or Hung Kai, or Hung K, something like that. Yeah. This was fucking awesome, guys. 
So anyway, thank you for watching. Please be sure to leave a comment and let me know what you thought. Give the video a thumbs up if you liked it, and subscribe if you want to see more. And check the description for all the other bandmate reactions I've done. There's a ton of them on there by now. And yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow with another one. Later.